Hey, what's up? This is The Trailer Project, I'm Alex Miller, and today we are going to check out the trailer for Ronnie Yu's 1993 film, The Bride with White Hair. Uh, Ronnie Yu would go on to direct uh, Freddy vs. Jason and Bride of Chucky, but don't despair, The Bride with White Hair is a goddamn masterpiece of Woot Shaw action. So without further ado, let's check out the trailer for The Bride with White Hair, starring Bridget Lin, Leslie Chung, and a bunch of other awesome Hong Kong character actors. So. Let's check it out. That beautiful, lavish, uh, blue day-for-night cinematography is uh, very distinct and unique to the period. It makes the film all the more enjoyable. This lavish use of blue would also emphasize another primary color used to a great maximum here, and that would be the color red. Blood red. As you can see, plenty of people are getting their heads lopped off and getting cut in half and whatnot. That's just all in a day's work on a Hong Kong movie set. Now look at that, there's the one and only Bridget Lin. Some have referred to her as the uh, Greta Garbo of Hong Kong cinema. And in The Bride with White Hair, she's playing a very, uh, a very stoic, witchy, unattainable, uh, statuesque uh, sword goddess, which she plays perfectly. While the film is indeed violent, the bloodshed isn't gratuitous or very gory. Um, the bloodshed is actually quite uh, artistic and uh, at times very beautiful. Alright, so you can see they're trying to play up the romantic angle here. Uh, Leslie Chung is checking her out. See, Leslie Chung's the, you know, disciplined sword fighter from the old school. And, uh, you know, she's a witchy chick who lives underneath the waterfall. They'll never accept your love. You see, that's some foreshadowing right there. That, uh, that hair is just uh, up to no good from the beginning. See, this is something that I really love about the movie, is that they really aren't afraid to get into how uh, freaky this uh, cult is. There's a lot of, you know, tribal stuff and dancing and freaky music. Yeah, see, uh, Leslie Chung's playing up that, uh, you know, handsome, long hair, sad boy thing. Um, he's really giving Kit Harrington a run for his money. It's been said before, and I'll say it again, Jon Snow, you really do know nothing. Alright, so enough of this love junk back of the action. See, you get the awesome gravity-defying sword fighting. Um, King Hu uh, really uh, took off with it in the 60s and 70s with, uh, you know, a touch of zen, come drink with me, and the valiant ones. Then it went one step further in the 80s and 90s with uh, Troy Hark, uh, Ching Su Tung, and uh, Ronnie Yu here in the Bride with White Hair. And then uh, went on to inspire people like the Wachowskis and Ong Lee and uh, keeps on being awesome to this day. So The Bride with White Hair, uh, this is one of those movies that I like so much, I uh, press it on everyone I know, and I've had to rebuy it multiple times because I've lent it out so many times, and uh, some of those times I haven't gotten it back. With this film, you really do get a little bit of everything. There's a good dose of the supernatural, there's a lot of martial arts inspired action, a lot of uh, high flying, wuxia sword play, you get a decent love story, and um, I would recommend tracking down a copy. There's a uh, Region B Blu ray out there, uh, but a DVD will work just as well. Just don't watch the English dub, please. Thank you for watching. This has been Alex from The Trailer Project. Uh, hit like, subscribe, leave a comment, and we'll check you later. Bye.